means marriage isn't something you happen to find. It is something you make and must keep on making it. It is about a choice and you must keep on choosing to love and respect one another. I believe that when two people are truly in love, you can see it in their eyes. And I see that love in both of your eyes. Robbie came along later in life for Kate, for Kate and I. And Robbie, we both, he's just the best thing that ever happened to us as far as that later in life. We always tell everybody that, that God knew that we couldn't handle another girl, so he gave us Robbie. <laughs> Mary is our only daughter. You can imagine. Uh, she came in our life in 1996. Elizabeth and I did not have anybody before. And from that time, she been, you know, working with us. Um, I can say, mostly to her friends, and they can identify that Mary is very good, very kind, generous, giving. Mary has been raised as a Christian girl, and Kay and I, um, our real only hope for Robbie was that he would find a Christian person to be with for the rest of his life. And the in interesting thing about Mary is Mary and Tara went to school together, so that's how Robbie got to meet Mary. One day, Mary, you know, Tara comes home and introduce, introduces married to, you know, our family, and so there, the rest is history. Robbie, very respectable. He don't go during the daytime, the, the night. He came to us. He talked to us. He said it to us, and we look one another and we're like, wow, okay. And he's been good all through. We gather here today to witness and celebrate an act of deep love. Mary and Rob, in their devotion, respect, and love for each other, wish to unite in the bond of marriage and dedicate themselves to each other's happiness and well-being as husband and wife. Robbie, it is no secret how indecisive I can be. But one thing I want to make very clear is that with complete certainty, you are the person I want to spend the rest of my life with. It's one of those things that people say that it's a God thing, but it truly was God that brought us together and to see where we are now is amazing. You are my best friend. You are my inspiration to get up every day and to give my best. This is why you make every day better and most importantly, you make me better. For those reasons, I know why God put you in my life and why I thank Him every single day that you are continuing in my life. I'm only excited for what God has in store for us. And just to think that six and a half years ago, we were literally children trying to figure out what an adult life was and falling in love was such a wild ride. A ride that required to have someone who is patient, caring, funny, strong, and faith-driven. Whether it means jamming to Taylor Swift for an excessive amount of hours, or to being a shoulder to cry on. I promise to love you unconditionally through the good times and the bad times. I promise that as we adventure through life, Together, I will always be on your side, loving you, pushing you, and celebrating you. No matter what life brings to us, I promise to listen when you don't feel heard. I promise to see you when you don't feel seen. I promise to be your hype man and to be your number one fan. I will always be, your, be first to give you my best for the rest of my life. Not only because you deserve it, but because we deserve it. I love you. Now what I can promise 
is to do from today and forever is to be your best friend and voice of reason, to continuously be praying over you and over our lives as a family, to always laugh at your jokes and make you feel like you're the funnier one, even though we both know it's me. <laughs> I vow to be your biggest fan and partner in crime. I promise to support a family with you in a home filled with patience, love, and understanding. I'm about to grow old with you. And lastly, I will definitely keep our lives exciting, adventurous, yet planned, and full of passion. <laughs> and I can't wait to start this new and exciting adventure with the person I love the most in the world. Mary and Rob have given themselves to each other in the solemn exchange of vows and rings. By the authority of the laws of Georgia, I formally and officially announce that they are lawfully married, husband and wife, you may kiss the bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, relatives, friends, guests, it is my privilege and honor to introduce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Rob and Mary Tuma. Yeah, okay. I like to do things the way I do things. Mm -hmm. And when I do things, I like to do things the way I do things. Mm -hmm. It's been a minute since I've been on solo dolo. And I'm feeding for some vices on the low low. I'm gonna do what I do when I keep it on lock. When I move, when I groove, when I make that thing pop. Pace yourself, brace yourself, things about to get wild. Relax yourself, release yourself, things about to get wild. Things about to get wild. 